Hey guys and welcome back to some more Assassin's Creed Syndicate. Today we're checking out the brand new DLC called Jack the Ripper. So he's one of the most famous serial killers ever and we're going to try and find him, track him down and hopefully stop him in Assassin's Creed Syndicate. That is the plan. Right, so let's jump into it and let's see what this DLC is about. I don't really know, so this is quite exciting. Who's this? I don't recognise your face. Jacob? Can't be, surely. I, know, I think I know Evie's involved in this DLC in some way, but not, who's who's this guy? He looks like an assassin. Or maybe a Templar. Oh! Uh. For 20 years, after the assassins defeated the Templars in London, the city enjoyed a certain peace. Until the Autumn of Terror. In 1888, London is plunged into shadow and fear by a series of gruesome and unsolvable murders. The brothels of Whitechapel seem warm and safe by comparison to its streets, where prostitutes are being mutilated and left on grotesque display for the world to ogle. Jacob Fry hunts the elusive killer to bring an end to the terror of Jack the Ripper. Get a move on, Mr. Finch. This is the story of a lifetime. Mr. Weaversbrook, I know you have more of the Ripper's letters. I told you to stay away from me. Stop publishing his letters. You've turned an unknown miscreant into a legend, and that's exactly what he wants. Jacob, thank God I found you. It's the Ripper. He's done it again. Oh, he can't. No, he can't have. And Lizzie, not both. Not in one night. Nelly, remember what I said. Now go. How many more assassins must die before you see the truth? Only one more, Jack. You should have believed, Jacob. Now, I will hunt you down. So that was Jacob, just with a fancy new haircut. Whoa, who are we right now? Are we Jack, we Jack the Ripper? Jack. The master of terror is afraid to show himself, is he? I am your shadow, Jacob. We're following Jacob. What is going on? What is going on? Yeah, don't don't mind me. When that guy's getting completely freaked out. I don't I don't what's it like a sack over our head or something? Covering our face, our 